Welcome to Headline News 24/7. Please click like and subscribe. Breaking news out of Texas. Holy hell. A jury in Texas has convicted a man of killing a female college student whose body was found inside of a kiddie pool dismembered and charred, with her heart cut out. He has been sentenced to life in prison. I'll say it again. People like this should face a firing squad and shot dead one bullet costs less than a dollar and blanks are cheap as well. We are looking at $10 instead of keeping this monster alive in an overcrowded prison at the cost of $125,000 to $250,000 per year or more. It's not cheap to keep these monsters behind bars. Charles Dean Bryant, 31, was found guilty of murder in the death of 24-year-old Jacqueline Van Dagriff, whom he had met at a bar in September 2016. Texas TV reported. Bryant was also sentenced to 20 years in prison for tampering with evidence. The sentences will be served concurrently. Bryant's defense attorney, Glynis McGindy, argued that Van Dagriff, who was a student at Texas Women's University in Denton, died accidentally during kinky consensual sex with Bryant, Fox News reported. The lawyer said a plastic tie was placed around Van Dagriff's neck, causing asphyxiation, and Bryant panicked. Prosecutors argued that there's no evidence Bryant and Van Dagriff had sex. Bryant, according to McGindy, then disposed of the 24-year-old's body, he went to Walmart at 4 a.m. and bought a shovel and goes back to his house where he had left Jackie and tried to dig a hole but the earth was too hard, but he did not commit murder. Prosecutor Lucas Allen countered that Bryant didn't freak out because Van Dagriff died, but that he deliberately killed her and calmly dismembered her body while cutting out her heart. Why cut out the heart? What does it have to do with disposing of a body? He cut her heart out, Allen told jurors on Monday, according to the Fort Worth Star-Telegram. I want that image to sink in. Van Dagriff was found dead on September 14, 2016, in Acorn Woods Park near Grapevine Lake, roughly 30 miles northwest of Dallas. Her body, according to an arrest affidavit, was found inside of a kiddie pool, and firefighters determined that an accelerant was used to start the fire. The college student had reportedly met Bryant at a bar in Denton and went to a second bar before leaving together. Her cell phone was traced back to Bryant's home, and her purse was found in his trash, the Dallas Morning News reported, citing a police affidavit. Court records show Bryant had been arrested twice in early September 2016, just a week before his date with Van Dagriff, for allegedly stalking his teenage ex-girlfriend, who told police she had seen a blue kitty pool in his backyard. The jury deliberated the sentences for about an hour Monday afternoon. The same jurors convicted Bryant earlier Monday after less than three hours of deliberation. Bryant's attorney sought a 20-year sentence for his client but he got life in prison. Ah! Such a tragic situation. Again, this monster should be put down immediately. One bullet done. Rest in peace young lady. As for the monster that did this you will rot in hell you son of a bitch. God bless. That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click like and subscribe. Thank you.